I, Gideon Solonka, having been appointed member of the selection panel for nominees for appointment as members of the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission, do swear that I will at all times obey, respect, and uphold the Constitution of Kenya and all other laws of the Republic, that I will faithfully and fully, impartially, and to the best of my ability, discharge the trust and perform the functions and exercise the powers devolving upon me by virtue of this appointment without fear, favor, bias, affection, ill will, or prejudice. So help me God. I, Elizabeth Adundo Mayor, having been appointed member of the selection panel for nominees for appointment as members of the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission, do swear that I will at all t times obey, respect, uphold the Constitution of Kenya and all other laws of the Republic, that I will faithfully and fully, impartially, and to the best of my ability discharge the trust and perform the function and exercise the power devolving upon me by virtue of this appointment without fear, favor, bias, affection, ill will, or prejudice. So help me God. Joseph Ngumi Mutia to take his oath of office.
I, Reverend Father Joseph Ngumbi Mutie, having been appointed member of the selection panel for nominees for appointment of members of the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission, do swear that I will at all times obey, respect, and uphold the Constitution of Kenya and all other laws of the Republic, that I will faithfully and fully, impartially, and to the best of my ability, discharge the trust and perform the functions and exercise the powers devolving upon me by virtue of this appointment without fear, favor, bias, affection, ill will, or pre pre uh, prejudice. So help me God. And then I'll call um, Faroudin Suleiman Abdallah. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. La ilaha illa anta. I, Dr. Faridun Suleiman Abdullah, having been appointed member of the selection panel for nominees for appointment as, a mem as members of the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission, do swear that I will at all times obey, respect, and uphold the Constitution of Kenya and all other laws of the Republic, that I will faithfully and fully impartially and to the best of my ability, discharge the trust and perform the function and exercise the powers devolving upon me by virtue of this appointment without fear, favor, bias, affection, ill will, or prejudice. So help me God.
members of the selection committee, uh, friends that have joined you, and uh, the four states. Uh, good afternoon. Let us start at the beginning. This ceremony um, does two things. The first is a promise to God by the oath you have taken that you're going to do right things and do them rightly. The second is a statutory requirement um, that part we have done. You do not need me to tell you that in this country we take elections very, very passionately. And that you should have been picked to be the people, to pick the people that are going to ensure that the right thing is done. It's not a main fit. And I do hope to God that you're taking the task placed upon you seriously and that you will remember that while you can cheat everybody, there are two people you will not be able to cheat. And the first one is actually yourself. So if you go there and pick pe people on grounds other than their competence, we shall be watching. The other person you cannot cheat is God. And so, if you are not accountable to yourself on the last day, you will account to your maker. And so, um, as I wish you well and congratulate you, I must remind you that the task you are just about to embark on is not a small task. And if the people you bring to us cause us problems, in August next year, we shall go back to the beginning. And the beginning is you today and the oath you have taken. Um, you had the choice of refusing to be appointed, as you had the choice to refuse to take the oath. But having accepted the appointment, having accepted to take the oath, and promise before man and God that you're going to do the right thing, we shall expect you to do nothing but the right thing. It isn't easy, but I imagine the reason you were picked is because we believed in you and that you can do the right thing and do it rightly. I wish you all the best on my own behalf and on behalf of the entire judiciary family and on behalf of the people of Kenya, please go and give us the team that will bring peace to the Republic of Kenya in August next year and in following years. All the best to you. Thank you very much.